this video, we will see a problem on involute of a square. So the question is, draw an involute of a square of side 20 mm. So here I am drawing a light horizontal line. Measuring 20 mm over it. Then drawing vertical lines through these points. Taking the same 20 mm. Marking it on both the sides. Then joining them. Next here I'll give the notations. After that, I have to draw the involutes. Involute is a curve which is generated when we unwound a string from the given surface. Like here in this example, the surface is a square. So at first, there is a string which is wound around the square. And next, when I am unwounding it, in that case, the generated curve is called as the involute. And since square has four sides, so the length of the string which will be unwound that will be corresponding to the perimeter of the square so if the side is 20 perimeter will be 4 into side that is 4 into 20 which is 80 mm so for that from point number 1 because i'll be unwounding it from point 1 i am taking the reference is 80 mm length this will indicate the perimeter Next, after this, I'll draw a light line through point 2, then light line through point 3. Next, keeping center at point number 2, distance up to point 1. drawing an arc next keeping 3 as the center distance up till here where I had ended bringing it up to point 3 after this keeping it at point 4 Drawing a light arc where I had ended up to this is the radius. Next, I'll draw a light vertical line through here. Then keeping the center at point 1 and radius up to the perimeter which I had marked previously. I will join these curves. Light. Then after making it light, here I will be drawing this in volume dark. Then making this curve dark. So this distance, it is the perimeter, which is 4 into side I'll give the dimension to this square twenty mm by twenty mm
so this curve would be called as an involute of a square and here over this also i can give the notations like i'll say that where i had started it unwinding that will be point a here this is point b c d and point e so this is the involute we are getting when the string has been unwounded from a square with this we complete the problem